to the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. I never see anyone like you. I never see anyone like you. Hey, I never see anyone like you. I never see Where's Sam? Help me. Like I never see anyone like you. 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 Everyone stand up. Let's pray some prayers before. Let's pray some prayers while they are working on the people. Everyone say after me in the name of Jesus. Please say be serious in the name of Jesus. Father, tonight visit me. This is my destiny. Give me strange results. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Visit me. In the name of Jesus, visit me. Step into my destiny. Step into my destiny. Step into my destiny. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Shout it again in the name of Jesus. Every long standing issue in my life. And my destiny I declare that you must give way tonight lift your voice and begin to pray long-standing challenges Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please, if you can, pair yourselves into two and pray this prayer. If you are holding a child or you are doing something, that's all right. Otherwise, find somebody, a serious neighbor, hold a hand. I want you to agree. Say in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare that the door for the next level of my life and that of my neighbor must be open now. Lift your voice and pray. Agree. If any two shall agree, as touching. 
what you are saying you are opening doors Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are still holding your hands. Say in the name of Jesus. Father, tonight, take away shame. Take away mockery from my life, my family, and my neighbor. Lift your voice and pray seriously. Roll away the reproach. Roll away the reproach of mockery. Roll away the reproach of shame. Roll away the reproach. Pray. Roll away the reproach. Hallelujah. Say in the name of Jesus. Father, expose every force, every yoke, every spirit behind the tragedies in my life, in my destiny, and my family. Expose them tonight. Lift your voice and pray. For the light shines in darkness. Pray for the light shines in darkness. Let your light shine, O God. Hallelujah. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Lord, let your anointing, let your unction locate me tonight and turn my life around. Lift your voice and pray that the power of God must locate me. Change my destiny. Let your power pray. One encounter with the anointing of the Holy Ghost can wipe your tears, my brother, my sister. Pray. Light me, Lord, light me, Lord, light me, Lord, like a candle. Light me, Lord, light me, Lord, light me, Lord, like a candle. Light me, Lord, light me, Lord, light me, Lord, like menorah. Light me, Lord.
listen listen to me i will just give you an instruction just help those under the anointing but listen to me carefully please everyone do you know the reason why we minister deliverance listen listen carefully you have to understand this the reason why we minister deliverance you don't spend your whole life going through deliverance however there are lives come my dear when a spirit listen carefully when a spirit latches onto your life and destiny brothers and sisters let me tell you i don't care what you do physically remember spiritual intelligence you can be doing the right physical things but the presence of a spirit representing an embargo representing a covenant an authorization for your doom will keep you down there and you find out that your life will never open up when people gather like this hear me they come with prayer requests they come with problems but you see behind those problems are spirits are we together now the spirits that are responsible for lack of favor the spirits that are responsible for a hard life the spirits that are responsible for infirmity all kinds of cases you know one of our dear people here in the ministry i prayed over the father's picture i've seen those kinds of cases on television and all of that but you could look at the leg and see the bone the bone the flesh had eaten to a point that you could see the bone what happened to the man he went to bed in the night brothers and sisters i think somebody did something for him in a dream and he woke up physically and his legs started eating up the bible says the whole world lieth in wickedness you want to move forward but there is an embargo the solution is not counseling you need an encounter with power everybody say power listen the power of the holy spirit is not a negotiator it's an enforcer when the power of god comes it does not ask you whether you want to be free your assignment is to be open till it reaches you when it comes it scatters anything that does not look like god lift your hands everyone just lift your hands and be silent i'll pray for you now the spirit of god is upon me lift your hands everyone there are people here right now i want you to bring there are the first sets of people who will come out ushers grace for you and protocol i know you have a lot of work today because there's such a crowd right to the road but i want to pray everyone please lift your hands the lord is speaking to me there are people right now in your silence hold on maybe just this the power of god will begin to come upon you what is happening right now before we pray for the sick is massive deliverance that deliverance is equal to breakthrough equal to new levels but lift your hands there are people here who are under strong yokes of delay and the lord gives me an instruction we will just lift our hands and be silent that's all the instruction and inside and outside the spirit of god will begin to locate them are we together when that happens then we'll take it off from there that's the first thing god wants to do tonight just lift your hands everyone thank you jesus the lord is asking me to stretch my hands and there are people and families and those following on online except you are not under the influence of the spirit of delay that spirit must leave you are we together so keep your hands lifted thank you jesus lord wherever they are right now i stretch my hands according to the instructions you have given me inside and outside right now i see the anointing of the spirit already falling over the spirit of delay keep your hands lifted Shalakataya. bring them out outside there just the angels of the lord are walking i'm seeing like smoke just moving across lines line by line inside and outside when it comes to you when you are under that influence that's the end of it right now i command it the word of the lord is upon this prophecy in the name of jesus no instruments don't play anything outside there is massive deliverance happening separation from delays separation from delays bring them out thank you 
Thank you, Jesus. Delays. You want to move forward, but the spirit ties you down. It's over right now. No, you can't dodge it. You are under an atmosphere. There is an influence. The influence of the spirit. Line by line, the Holy Ghost is moving. Row by row. There is no faking it. Line by line. Lord, every row, every line, every individual. Let no one in this category escape it. For the sake of your mercy and your grace. No matter where you are, inside and outside, online, don't worry. The Spirit of God is moving. One by one, it must catch up with you. The word of the Lord is upon it. Bring them out. Young, old. Destinies that have been delayed. Tonight there is serious grace for deliverance. Hey, da kata la gata para da gata. Shige de ge de ge de ge de ge de bala. Shala kara kata tata ba. Those of you lifting up your hands, be sensitive. Be sensitive. We're in a prophetic atmosphere right now. Malata sada ba secretes ke barite shobra hasaya. Bring them. I see people outside. Kai, my God. My God, my God, my God, my God, my God, my God, many people, many people, many people, many people. There's someone you are following from Kenya, you are watching from a laptop, the anointing, your hands are shaking. The spirit of the Lord is upon you, judging every darkness. tonight you will be located by God you prayed it you must be free please help the ushers if there are too if there are too few protocol join them different departments help them the Lord really wants to set people free it's a year of triumph don't think these people are just coming out for show they represent breakthroughs these are the people who God wants to give testimonies darkness raging over the lives of people they came from different places how will god leave them that way right now all of you in front here i decree and declare to those spirits at the count of three let them go you know my voice one two three go 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 out of their lives now out now i command you by the influence of the spirit i decree and declare let their destinies go delay broken go now hallelujah now lift your hands my god you'll be surprised at what will happen now Everyone say after me in the name of Jesus. Say it again in the name of Jesus. Say it again in the name of Jesus. The grace for open doors right now. Break every chain in my life. Keep your hands lifted. Watch it happen now. That's the instruction God gave me. That grace breaking chains now. I'm speaking across the congregation. I have been seeing this for weeks. Padlocks opening in the realm of the spirit. That's what the Lord is showing me. Padlocks opening, opening, opening right now. I open them. I'm under the shadow of yours. Your influence is all over me. I'm under the shadow of yours. Your influence is all over me. I'm under the shadow. Your influence is all over me. Oh, Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Fire 
is coming on 32 people and this fire that is coming upon them is to break family altars i hear family altars right now oh god in the name of jesus one two three i set those altars now on fire right now 32 people i see in the realm of the spirit i command it right now i command it everyone on this ground under the influence of any altar now be free now help them please help that lady be free now right now be free now be free now your influence is all over me i'm under the shadow of your own everyone lift your hands say this after me in the name of jesus please say it seriously say in the name of jesus any spirit that has had access to my life and is causing destruction hear the word of the lord as i shout the name jesus i command you to live my life at the count of three shout jesus there will be an exiting of many strange spirits one two three shouting i command spirits you go now you go now you go now you go now inside and outside any spirit resident within any man's life any woman's life causing pain Hallelujah. Oh, as I pray for grace for you in Jesus' name. Because what I see now is not a nice thing. The Lord is asking me that we shout Jesus. There are people who are going to vomit physical things. That's why I said it's a messy scene. I, I apologize. We're a very neat and organized people inside and outside. But in the name of Jesus right now, any stranger in your body at the count of three must go out now. One, two, three. I command every stranger. Go now. Every poison. Every devil causing sicknesses, every fibroid, every devil, every enchantment. Hallelujah. The Lord is showing me a vision of a lady. If you're here, I want you to come out. I'm seeing your family doing something like a sacrifice. And they are giving somebody, everybody a substance. Like a drink. Something to take. They gave everybody, including you, and you took it. Where is that person? Please, if you're here, I want you to come out quickly. It's a, it's a highly diabolic thing they gave everybody. Where are you? Come. Your deliverance comes now. I'm under the shadow of your wings. Help me. Your influence is all upon me. Let's have another mic, please. Hold on. Stand up, my dear. Is this the lady? Two of them? Stand up. Where are you from? Look at me. Huh? Kogi State. What happened to you? Hold on. I converted. Hold on. I'm looking at you, Kai. This thing. 
you entered a covenant eh? yes. with who i don't know my mother i don't know they she brought somebody and you people entered a covenant and they gave you something hold my hands shout jesus I command that covenant that demonic thing time your life in this miracle service it lives now in the name of jesus you too where are you from, I'm from kogi state. you are from kogi state the same thing hold my hands look at me i command that devil to leave you now whatever yoke please don't come out if i don't call your case are you part of them mr man young man you're part of them in the name of jesus i set you free bring the, you, are, you too come make sure that so that we don't get the place rowdy be delivered now help her out be free now out i'm interested in this lady please stand up my dear if you can this lady's whole family is in bondage whole family the entire family nothing is working in your family the lord wants to deliver you right now hold my hands I command that spirit your time is up leave this family now in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ i break the yoke over your life now out now there is a lady you have been coughing blood where are you you are coughing literally and blood is coming out there is a lady like that please where are you let's hurry up we have a lot to do this night the lord is asking me to minister to a lady that coughs and then blood you cough blood who is that inside outside except you are under the anointing please come out quickly i want to pray for that person now where are you how long hold on just just keep up where's the mic how long you you are an usher you how long three weeks eh? three weeks. for three weeks you've been caught lay your hand on your chest you too lay your hands on your chest you too huh substance your what hold on please guys hold on yours is what the substance you spoke about what substance we given some medicine to take in the family lift your hands lift your hands lift both of them i'm seeing an angel pouring something on your hand your hand will start shaking and then the lord is bringing you strange deliverance it will start from your hands down to your body i place the word of god upon your life right now in the name of jesus christ both of you look at me both of you cough out blood in the name of jesus i lay my hands upon you it ends now in the name of jesus out right now there are spirits responsible for this kind. Ta, 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 ta. Do you know what I just saw? The Lord opened my eyes and I saw like a cage. And in the cage, I saw snakes. That's all I'm seeing. That's all I'm seeing. Lift your hands, everybody. The Lord is just asking me to wave my hands over the congregation. There are people who represent that oppression. It will leave now. The Lord is asking me to wave my hands. Lord, as you have said, I see snakes in cages. Whose destiny is that? Right now, whose destiny is that? I wave my hands in the name of Jesus. Please release them for your glory. Release them now. Help them, please, Jesus Christ. Inside, outside. Be out of that cage now. I see snakes, serpents. Some of you see them in your dreams. They must go now. They are leaving you now. Now. They are leaving you now. I command liberty. 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 Hallelujah. I'm hearing a name, Jane. Jane, like J A N E. Jane. 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 I'm also hearing another name, Victory. Is it Victory? Like Victory. Victory. Please don't come out if that's not your name. What's your name? Jane. 
Your name is Victory. Where are you from? Delta State. Delta State. I have to pray for you. Your family is being seriously oppressed. Why are you people here? You are all Jane. Jane, your name is Victory. I want to pray for you. Kaza Chat. Kaza Chat. Is it Kaza Chat? Who is that? Kaza Chat. I'm hearing that name. That's that's like a Kaduna name. Kaza Chat. Please, who is that? The breakthrough of your family has come. Kaza Chat. Is it? I don't know why God is going to Kaduna now. Nom. Is it Nom Shu or Nom Shu or something like that? I don't know if there's a name like that. Nom Nom Shu or something like that. Nom something. Please, if that is your name, you are. Why are they here? I call their names. I'm going to lay hands on you. Except for you, I don't even know why the rest of you are. But please, I want you to believe. The moment I lay my hands on you, something will happen. The Lord is saying I should start with you. Lord, open her door now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hold my hands. Reproach leaves your life now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Reproach leaves your life now. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Reproach leaves your life now. Reproach lives your life now. Hold my hands. Call your parents and tell them the Lord is giving them breakthrough. Your family, your entire family, Delta State, breakthrough right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Hold on. The serious witchcraft over your life. Hold my hands. Lord, the Lord is asking me to walk with you. This is how your destiny is opening up. That's what the Lord is asking me to do. Walk with you. To walk with you. Something is happening. It's a prophetic act. You will not help her to walk with you. Opens in the name of Jesus. Your destiny opens up now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lift your hands. This girl, lift your hands where you are. I'm seeing wind around you. And the Lord is that wind is going anti-clockwise anti-clockwise and the lord said his restoration i stretch my hands upon you right now i release that grace for restoration restoration there are seven other people who will tap from this anointing this same anointing right now seven seven right now the anointing for restoration is coming upon them receive it right now wherever you are hallelujah i'm seeing one mama outside it's like you came here with your daughter or something i'm seeing a woman sit down with her daughter outside now that's all i'm giving about you please if you can find that woman and if you understand what i've said i want you to run and come I want to pray for the sick now but God is delivering people God is delivering people Seth Seth who is Seth S-E-T-H S-E-T-H your name is Seth 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 the Lord is stepping into his life right now Seth is there someone with that name Seth Have you found the mama I'm talking about? Don't worry, let them come. Let them come. Doesn't matter. With your daughter. Mama. Kai. There is the spirit of death on your family. I'm going to pray for you. Don't be afraid. I'm not a prophet of doom. You came from where, mama? from Edo State. From Edo State? Yes, but I'm living in Wusasa. You live in Wusasa? Yes. But you came from Edo State. Yes. I must pray for you. There, why is he here? Who is this gentleman? Seth. You too? You are an usher? 
Okay. Kai, this is not the set I'm seeing. No, I will pray for you. But I'm seeing someone else. Eh? Please, don't be embarrassed. I want to pray for somebody now. Huh? Because I'm seeing an accident killing you. And you took, what's the name of this thing they take? Wee wee. And you were high. You were about to cross the road. And then I'm seeing a truck with the name Angote on it. Just running and killing you. There is somebody here. You smoke. Please don't be. There's nothing to be embarrassed about. It's not like you are not a serious person. But this thing, you started taking it from when you were small. And it's destroying your life. You want to be free. But you can't leave it. Please don't be ashamed. Come out now. Quickly, please. If you are still thinking about it, remain on your seat. Some You have to be free now. Come out. I'm seeing one. You wore jeans dress. Like your shirt. I don't know if it's your shirt. It's jeans. Who is that? No, no. There, there's another. Come out. I will pray for you. This, this is not the only guy. Just keep them here. I will pray for him. I'm seeing another person outside the second overflow. You are standing on the road. The Spirit of God is speaking to you. Speaking to you. This thing they roll and they smoke. And then you even, I'm seeing you swallowing a drug. I don't know what drug is that. Please come out. Come out. Clap for them as they come out. Join them quickly and come. Whether I mention your case or not. You are involved in any kind of liquor and addiction. Indian hem, whatever, forward march. Come here, your salvation. Come, sir. Please appreciate them. Clap for them. Some of them are not bad people. It's a spirit. Don't be ashamed. Please, usher, uh, direct them so that they come here. I'm seeing up to five ladies in this group. Up to five ladies. Come. Don't be ashamed. Don't let anyone laugh at you. Please, this is a miracle service. Join them. We, we, Codeine. Whatever it is, join them. Whether you know the name of what you are smoking or swallowing or not, come and join them. Please, quickly, that addiction must be broken now. Who can stand against the Lord? No one can. No one will. Keep coming. The devil is a liar. Who can stand against our king? No one can. hallelujah i'm seeing a very small boy very small boy very small boy who is supposed to join them young man please hold on please if the parents of the boy are here don't flog him please this is a very small boy you will not even know that this boy is wise to smoke this thing he saw an elderly person smoking it come out there is a small boy here i know what drag him out come where is the boy come out please gentlemen i'm going to pray for you don't worry you are not bad people i'm seeing a number of ladies up to five ladies they are refusing to come out there's nothing to be embarrassed jesus christ wants to set you free this is a miracle service it's not like you have evil people that's not what we're saying it's a spirit you don't stop by counseling mama there is a spirit of death over your family and i will pray for you i will pray for you in the name of jesus who is this your daughter what's your name my dear lillian. Hold on. is this mic working can you add lillian, the voice lillian. lillian what do you want god to do for you i want god to heal you what's wrong with you i mean i have a problem with my tongue no 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 you had a dream huh you saw a snake you can't even remember it and from that day you started having serious problem with your stomach huh what's wrong with you i've 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 got to test and 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 they told me that it's a, a liver problem liver problem yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
because i look at you and you would think you are pregnant but you are not pregnant your stomach is swelling up mama is that true how long has it been look at look at look at evil and wickedness are you married because you see now assuming a brother has been trusting god to marry this sister do you think the brother will marry her please help me do you think he will marry her you look at her now and you think she's five or six months pregnant but she's not pregnant Kai. There is a lady who has refused to come out. The power of God is going to come upon her outside. You are supposed to be part of those who will be delivered here. I'm seeing the angel of the Lord outside. That lady, you were a sincere lady. But I, I don't know if it's um, another lady. I don't want to say what I'm seeing, not to embarrass you. Because the, what you were introduced to is not only smoking this. There are other things that I see that I may not be able to talk about. I'm asking you to come out. God wants you to be free for the sake of your family. The power of God is going to come upon you outside. Outside. To be free of this thing. My dear, look at me. This is koinonia. The Lord is going to set you free. You believe in miracles? Mama, you believe in miracles? Yes, I have to pray for you. Money runs away from you. Huh? Madam, I will pray for you. Mama? Yamuke. Do you hear how, sir? okay this is your daughter please be comfortable whatever language you can speak there is an interpreter here nobody says you must be able to speak english or whatever any language please if i call you here or you stand here for healing don't be under any pressure to say you must whatever language is comfortable speak it if i don't understand we'll find somebody to interpret please don't put yourself under pressure and say no we are excellent people, but we are not fools. We can't put anyone under pressure. Hallelujah. Mommy, I want to pray for you because I'm seeing the Lord bringing restoration to your life. This is what I am seeing. And the Lord is asking me to pray for you. Can I pray for you, ma'am? I will pray for you. I have to pray i'm seeing not you but i'm seeing somebody close to you having an accident traveling to abuja and having an accident we have to pray i'm not saying it will happen once god reveals it is broken lord jesus stretch your hands and let's pray for this mommy you don't have to know her please stretch your hands and pray lord we avert death we avert death now in the name of jesus christ we avert death by the power of the Holy Ghost. Mama. Is there a name like Gracilda? Is it Gracilda or Gracilda? Gracilda or Gracilda. Something like that. Gracilda, Gracilda. Something like that. If that sounds like your name, I'm sorry if I don't mention it well. The Lord kept mentioning it in my ears. Gracilda or Grisilda, something like that. If that is your name, please come out. Eh? Jacinta. No. But come. Where are you coming from? Zaria. Zaria, I have to pray for you. There's a gentleman who will destroy you. Be free now from every influence. Hold my hand anybody that is not designed by god i separate you and him forever say amen in jesus name gracilda gracilda i'm hearing gracilda something Hilda. please if it's not you no problem but that's what i'm hearing mama let's pray in the name of jesus christ i pray for you by the power of the holy spirit new beginning for you hold up please in the name of jesus christ my dear lay your hands on your stomach Kai. Lord Jesus, you gathered people here tonight to set them free. I cause the spirit responsible for this. I decree and declare that this stomach will shrink. Every devil will go away in the name of Jesus Christ. If you agree with me, say amen. amen. Look at me and you will never be barren in your life. 
say amen. amen there are two ladies you are inside here there is an embargo of barrenness on your family fire is coming on those two ladies now to break that embargo you don't even know it's in your family it may not be in your life but i'm seeing it right now the angel of the lord is locating two ladies right now and is breaking that embargo thank you father i put the word of god upon this prophetic word that embargo is broken right now right now right now two ladies two ladies there's no reason why you should come here and your life should be the same mama i will pray for you this is your daughter do you know that god is going to use this girl god will use your daughter for his glory hold my hands my dear there's small girl now but god will use you in the name of jesus christ i anoint you mama i decree and declare let hardship live your life in the name of jesus christ let hardship live your life in the name of jesus hold on i'm seeing a wind and the lord is asking me to follow it this is somebody's deliverance here this is somebody's deliverance here this is somebody's deliverance here this is somebody's deliverance the power of god is coming upon a few people as i'm walking across this place this is somebody's deliverance this is somebody's deliverance lord set them free right now right now right now i'm seeing something rolling around this row this row this row this row shala sobari atas kabanda bria legetege ba sharatos kabredia there's no hiding there's no hiding someone in this row someone in this row someone in this row hardship over your family is being broken right now i'm stretching my hands this row right there father locate that person right now right now right now right now right now in the name of jesus christ mama come i want you to rejoice look at me the lord hold on the lord is saying i should tell you that where you have been crying you will begin to laugh you have been crying for 30 years and the lord is saying your breakthrough has come in the name of the lord jesus christ please shoot for me come madam hold my hands the lord is there and she tell you it's your season of laughter in the name of jesus christ your season of laughter your season of laughter look at me lose her hands now lose her hands now lose her hands now in the name of jesus christ let her hands be loose your hands are tied i lose your hands in the realm of the spirit in the name of jesus christ open doors open doors open doors open doors open doors that's what the lord is saying open doors the lord has said you have waited too long it's time for the door of your destiny to be open open doors come there is a spirit in your life that makes bad boys look for you hold my hands leave her now out out when bad boys see you they can't leave you as they are passing they see you that spirit calls them back i don't know who this girl is you're a small girl but the things you know are what you have done out now in the name of jesus you have gone to places you should not go you have you have the phone numbers of people that if we know now i'm not saying you're a bad girl it's a spirit including married men they will be minding their business that spirit will call them to you i command that devil to leave you now leave you now in the name of jesus christ i want us to pray for these gentlemen before we pray for the sick you see let me tell you something addiction is a very wicked spirit don't look at them especially our dear sisters my brother what happened to you eh? gone short gone short yes, sir. who shot you i'm a soldier i was shot by my colleague 
Meduguri. You are Meduguri? Yes, sir. No. He wanted to kill you. Huh? Yeah. But he didn't kill you. He was directed to kill you. Hi. You are a soldier. How long has this been? It's going to seven months now. Seven months. Which where did they shoot? Your legs. And you can't walk with it. Look at me. You believe in miracles. Lift your crutch. Lift it. Lift it. Come. Come. Lift your legs. Go ahead. You are a soldier. Lift your legs. Look at this. Come on, Koinonia. Look at this. Lift your crutch up. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Walk as fast as you can. Don't be afraid. Turn around. Turn around. Come. Because your wound is not healing. There is a wound, but there is not healing. From today, I pray for you. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord who has perfected this leg will also perfect you. Where are you now? You are in Zaria. You are still in the force. Yes. You are still in the force. Ah? Huh? Yes, sir. I want to pray for you. Do you believe God can favor? Yes, sir. I have to pray for you. God is going to connect you with a senior person and he will lift you. Huh? Look at me, brothers and sisters. I want to break this addiction from your life now. Are we together? You are very sincere people. Some of you were initiated into this thing by bad friends. Some of you were initiated into these things by spirit. I'm going to lay my hands on you. While the congregation, whether your child is here or not, whether your brother is here or not, as you are praying, you are sowing a seed for your own home. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Stretch your hands. Don't look at anybody's face and run your mouth on any. It's none of your business. Koinonia is, a, is like a hospital. Stretch your hands. I will lay my hands on every one of them. Please, all of you should pray. I want to break addiction from your life. Don't feel condemned. Jesus will help you. It must be broken right now. Broken right now. Broken right now. Any kind of addiction. Out. Out. Now. Out. Out. In the name of Jesus. Out. Look at this guy. Out. Break from his life now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be set free. Be set free. As soon as I lay my hands on you, continue praying. Be set free. Addiction, break. Break in the name of Jesus. Hold my hands, darling. No addiction for liquor. No addiction for drugs. Something is leaving you. I'm seeing something like an arrow coming out of your head. Out of our life now. In the name of Jesus. I break that addiction. Ah. Hey Jimmy, come. The Lord is saying you should pray for this guy. He will pray for you. This guy needs serious prayer. Just lay your hands on him. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. Out! Out! Now! I command that devil. This is somebody that loves God but this addiction must be broken right now. I break it right now. I break it right now. Hold my hands. You are a nice lady, but we have to break this thing. Lord, please, for your mercy, let it be broken in her life. In the name of Jesus Christ. 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 Hallelujah. The Lord is asking me to minister to somebody. I'm seeing a very interesting case. You love God. Please don't be ashamed. There is a particular pain reliever you are addicted to. Who is that person? I want to pray for you now. Whether you are sick or not. Come and stand here. 
particular pain reliever you can't help it you can wake up 1 a.m in the night and swallow it it's a spirit pain reliever i'm not saying you are sick and they gave you in the hospital god is visiting addictions this night quickly come don't sit back and say i'm all right allow god set you free let them come look at this pain i don't know what it is but i hear my spirit pain reliever whether you are sick whether you are fine the urge will hook you and you have to go and get it if you you can prefer to take it than to eat food it must go right now that's why god put this meeting to help people there's one of you fire is coming on you now after that fire comes on you then i'll pray for the rest that's the instruction god is giving me one of you fire literal fire is coming upon you from heaven as i lay my hands upon you that addiction breaks right now stretch your hands and pray for them don't feel embarrassed broken now broken now broken now in the name of jesus addiction broken now broken now by the power of the holy ghost broken now broken right now by the power of the holy ghost broken now broken now if you have for prayers just move them forward broken now in the name of jesus broken now in the name of jesus broken now in the name of jesus it's broken now in the name of jesus broken in the name of jesus place your hand on your stomach god is not only setting you free he's setting you free from something else let her go now in the name of jesus christ addiction broken now addiction broken now by the power of the holy ghost addiction is broken now in the name of jesus christ broken now hold my hands let her go in the name of jesus christ there is a spirit that wants to destroy your life i command now there's no hiding place for you by the power of the holy spirit you must be set free you are standing in for somebody no problem in the name of jesus christ supernatural freedom hallelujah praise the lord now praise the lord please accept you are nursing a child or doing something let's all rise those outside they are still praying for you no problem all other people please stand up rise up i want us to pray if you are yet to submit your prayer request please do it quickly the bible says unto him that answers prayers shall all flesh come in one minute god can turn your life around everyone stretch your hands here and pray i'm going to lay hands on the request pray passionately from the depth of your heart lord i will not have to write this again pray i've written it the bible says after two days please if there are still people coming bring it quickly it says after two days he will revive us and on the third day he will raise us up online here please pray i'm laying my hands on this request and we're asking the god of heaven visit men and women are you praying now pray in the next one minute i'd like you to pray blast in tongues and say lord this is the last of the prayer request that i'm having to write concerning this issue hallelujah agree with me with a loud amen in the name of jesus christ 
I decree and I declare over every request gathered from this nation and from the nations of the earth online and here in our local environment Jesus I present to you impossible situations according to men and I ask you turn it around now turn it around now turn it around now let every breakthrough request here be turned into a testimony now every case here said by men to be impossible we we collide that case with the power of god and we produce testimonies now whoever must die for this prayer to be answered dies now whoever must live for this prayer to be answered lives now whoever must rise for this prayer to be answered rises now whoever must go down for this prayer to be answered goes down now whoever must hear god for this prayer to be answered hears god now father i pray in the name of jesus may your people not have to write this again agree with me may your people not have to write this again lord i pray that before miracle service april let every request here be turned into a testimony May the fire and the anointing of the Holy Ghost that makes all the difference let it rest on this request the same way fire fell from heaven to consume the sacrifice of Elijah may fire fall on this now it has been prayed for you will not write it again it has been prayed for you will not write it again in the name of Jesus Christ hallelujah please lift up your hands everyone hallelujah listen we're in a very strange season of the manifestation first of the spirit of revelation listen carefully there is a very spectacular outpouring God wants to upgrade the work of his people to access the mysteries of the kingdom not just to know him God wants to equip us with mysteries are we together number two there is a strange outpouring of the supernatural power of God for performance for performance not just that you had God and it never happens not just that you speak and it never happens number three this is personal to us as a family of faith god has declared that is our year of triumph i want you to believe this word oh believe it otherwise you will sit down and you will watch people rise from nothing and then you will keep clapping i'd like you to insist we still have a few minutes for this meeting to be done tonight insist that if you have never stood upon this altar to testify make up your mind and say no god i must stand before your people are you hearing what I'm saying? As I speak over your life now, among the many things I want to speak, right now, I want to activate upon your life the grace and the unction for performance. Many of you may not know what this anointing is. Listen carefully. Lift your hands. He said, who has ever heard that a city was built in one day? But as soon as Zion travails, 
there is a grace that is coming upon the people of god hear me for performance he said blessed is she that believes for unto her not unto them mm -mm, mm -mm. this is not a corporate thing unto her there shall be there are many things god has said that has not come to pass there is a grace that engenders performance i prophesy to you now in the name of the lord god who called me and sent me may that unction that will make results appear speedily let it come upon you like fire now let it come upon you like fire now receive it now is yours receive it now is yours receive it now is yours performance 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 shake it la bata la prete get a soto ropa shiata grace for performance everything hanging in the realm of the spirit that is already your portion released by god i decree within the next 30 days it appears physically now i prophesy the spirit of the lord is upon me i speak within the next 30 days it manifests in the name of jesus whatever has slowed down your pace in life so that you are not moving at the pace designed by god i put fire upon your feet and i command speed now i put fire upon your feet i command strength speed strength speed strength speed anything that has not yet worked in your life i don't know why but i'm prophesying i'm speaking to it start working now many of you don't understand what i'm doing to you start working now i don't know what projects you are currently on that has refused to produce i force it to bear fruit now I force it to bear fruit now. Hear me. The Lord spoke to my spirit and told me that the month of April for Koinonia, you may not believe it, but for Koinonia and everyone connected to this grace, the Lord said we will see a strange dimension of wealth and manifestation write this down brothers and sisters is the word of the lord i think i was telling you yesterday that the lord told me this you will see people that know nothing about money rise in a way that they themselves are asking what happened listen except the lord has not sent me i declare you must be part of the testifiers don't say i'm too small receive it don't be foolish in the name of jesus you must be a participant listen i tell you brothers and sisters please write this down you will see a strange rising rising write this down you will say i said it nothing to some i mean mysteriously people will have to ask what is happening it is a grace there is a grace that makes it happen i'm not talking of business i'm talking about the suffering word of god upon the life of a man may it be your portion in the name of jesus i decree upon you the kind of favor 
that will make even your enemies to say there is God in your life I release that dimension of favor now listen you can't rise in this kingdom without the favor of God you will struggle for nothing please hear me I prophesy it again whoever is lacking favor on his life I decree from this night carry favor inside outside everywhere online carry favor let me prophesy over finances whatever makes money run away from you don't say I'm talking about money you need it for what is coming in ahead whatever makes finances run from you whatever dug a hole in your life that makes you suffer in misery and penury I turn it around now I turn it around now I pray for every student here the kind of results you have never seen I release it to you now I release it by the spirit I release it from the spirit in the name of Jesus Christ anyone due for promotion here or anyone's family member rightfully due for promotion and either because of religious sentiments or because of ethno tribal sentiments they have trampled upon you i decree and declare may the angel of god responsible for lifting visit your destiny and ensure that your promotion must manifest I pray for your loved ones. I pray for you. Whoever is called jobless here, yeah, before next miracle service, get something doing now. I prophesy it again. Whoever is called jobless before next miracle service, I don't know how it will happen, but get a good job. There are people here trusting God for direction. Very clear direction for the next level of their lives. Could be maritally, could be geographic location, whatever it is. Hear God in this season like never before. Hear God in this season like never before. Lift your hands. I release upon you the grace for supernatural miracles receive it right now receive it right now sapoto so receive it right now from tonight i declare whoever you speak over and command their destinies to open may my god honor it i said may my god honor it Whoever fights you goes down immediately. Whoever fights you goes down immediately. Hear me? Whoever mocks your passion for God goes down immediately. Whoever has said over his dead body for you to rise, may his prayer be answered. Whoever has said over his dead body for you to rise in Koinonia tonight, may their prayers be answered. Every embargo of bad luck upon your face that makes your helpers look at you and turn aside, 
I tear that veil completely in the name of Jesus. Favor like never before. Testimonies like never before. Koinonia is the place of the anointing. Koinonia is the place of unction. I pray for you. A new, a fresh grace and anointing. Let it rest upon you like the dew of heaven. Begin to flow very effortlessly in the gifts of the Spirit. I'm praying it again. Begin to flow very effortlessly in the gifts of the Spirit. Begin to flow effortlessly in the gifts of the Spirit. The mantle of honor that God has put upon my life, God has put upon this ministry. You are part of this vision, you are under this grace. There's no reason why it should not work in your life. I command it to start speaking now. No more dishonor in your life. No more dishonor in your life. Hear me. For those who have been trying certain things for a long time, whether it's exams, whether it's admission, whatever you have been doing again, business, I don't care. I don't know where the embargo came from, but I break it right now. From today, any man that looks upon you, may God cause them to bless you. Whatever has killed your prayer life, this night, I release upon you the spirit of prayer and supplication. Listen. See, let me tell you something. Don't ever let people there are people who are under such passion for new things the system of the kingdom is dynamic but the foundations of the things that make men grow are the same prayer the word corporate fellowship obedience if you leave any of these things and you say you are looking for power or looking for anointing is a joke you will never find it one more time i restore your prayer life in the name of Jesus Christ I don't know what killed your passion for the word your passion for Bible study your passion for devotion your passion for the things of God but I command the restoration this night I don't know what took away your passion for the house of God but in the name of Jesus may a love for the house of God like never before come upon you in the name of Jesus the grace God released to bring the word triumph to come to pass in this ministry may that grace speak over you I speak over your life it is your year of triumph therefore whatever has mocked God in your life I command that in as you enter April from tomorrow you triumph over it hallelujah as you enter april it will not be april full it will be april wise it will be april breakthrough it will be april miracles it will be april speed agree with me again i'm praying with you between now and miracle service april please hear me results together with tears in your eyes for joy you will return with them results together with tears of joy in your eyes wave your hands and give jesus all the praise wave your hands and give jesus praise thank you lord for performance thank you lord for performance. dearly beloved i hope you were blessed by this message do not keep the video to yourself. Share to as many as you can to help them bless. Check our homepage for more of our messages. Subscribe to the channel. Comment on it. Like it. See you on our next video. Bye. Pray.
pray pray for your destiny the phase of development lord grant me the discipline 